You benefited uh, significantly from COVID. Talk to us about uh, the yeah. surge in demand and how you managed yeah. through. Yeah, I need, to, I need to qualify that statement first. We benefited tremendously from COVID. Let's quantify that as to what was the benefit of COVID. Uh, I'm going to give you a few, actually, uh, 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 I'll simplify the math. When you look at Chewy pre-pandemic, years 16, 17, 18, and 19, Chewy grew revenue, net revenue, Chewy grew revenue at the rate of $1.2 to $1.4 billion each year. So from the previous year, we added an incremental $1.2 to $1.4 billion to the next year. During the pandemic, we added $2.2 billion. And post-pandemic, 2021, we added $1.6 billion. So that gives you a kind of a range and a magnitude of uh, you know, the benefit that the pandemic provided us. And what it did is it brought in a lot more customers, and so it accelerated us on the customer acquisition curve. And now those customers are spending on a healthy basis on the platform, which has then provided a base lift of 20 to 30% from a previous run rate basis to the, to the, to the business. And, and we're incredibly proud of that. Uh, and so, you know, uh, the point of that is, you know, what you should take away is that net incremental revenue was growing on the back of fundamentals that I've talked about, innovations in verticals, customer acquisition, customer engagement in the verticals that I've talked about, so the inputs were already there. The pandemic just accelerated uh, a, a, a trend. I, I like to call it, I like to categorize it as the current and the tide. The current was already towards e-com. The pandemic brought in the high tide, right? That's sort of what happened. 